Hello, brothers and sisters of Black and Dark. Welcome, welcome, welcome to my page. Welcome to your doom. Which I talk about common sense. But I try to keep it down under the nitty gritty under 10 minutes. If it goes over 10 minutes, it's something very, 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 very important. These videos are not important to libertards, people who believe in God, people who are religious, people who are sensitive. Um, this is a majority, 80% of you. You're going to disagree to agree, okay? All right, you know, that kind of philosophy is just faltered in all types of ways, especially when you have to research to back up things. But not all research is factual, though. So these videos are not pertaining to the masses of masses. Hello, brothers and sisters of light. Welcome, welcome, welcome to my page, my page, my comment sense, but I try to keep it down. And then again, and in 10 minutes, if it goes over 10 minutes, it's something very, 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 very important. Not a point to liberals, libertars, people believe in God, people like to smoke, people like to drink, people like AOS, people like DMT. Listen to discretion is advised. Going down a rabbit hole, not up your asshole. Okay, your only friendly neighborhood schizologist in the go child on the internet right now. I don't sugarcoat my videos. Do you know that? I don't seek subscribers or validation. It's just me and my world, and you are around my world. Okay, all of you are outside my world. Okay, so am I outside your world, and vice versa. Okay. This video is going to be very important, okay? What I learned throughout my years of 49 years, December 3rd, <clears throat> 2023, I will be 49, yes. Yeah, so if you're older than me or younger than me, you may have lots to learn from me because you don't take the time to ponder and think like I do. Okay, you, you don't have that capability. You, you don't hear voices. You don't hear externalism, okay? You're not anything special. Everybody's special, but some people are more special than others. Not trying to be conceited. But this video, <clears throat> if you have any comments, questions, insults, or even roast fest, put it down below. I don't mind a little roast fest. You're not going to be blocked if it's funny. But if it's not funny, I'm going to block you. Okay. You're trying to do ad hominid attacks, but they're not really funny. Okay. Because I'm a comedic person. I'm many other things. Please read my credentials down below. Okay. Now you know I'm different from everybody else. Okay. And I'm more than the rest. Okay? Not to sound conceited or like Andrew Tate, which got himself in trouble. Or got himself killed like Kevin Samuels, rest in peace, his soul. I tried to tell him about that Red Bull. Red Bull is bad for you. Yeah. But we lost touch. Okay. But anyway, please, this video is going to be about eugenetics, genetics, the study of genetics. It is not a pseudoscience at all. It is not. Okay. When you study eugenetics, you know, study of genetics, I think you will become a racist. Okay. <laughs> You will automatically be dubbed as a racist. If people would tell that to me, I'm like, hey, um, I don't want to say too much because I know if I say this facts, okay, on here, and you can look it up yourself about genetics, about different types of genes, okay, you will find out what I'm saying is true. Sometimes I'll slip up and say something, okay, and they let it go, okay, but, um, there is a warrior gene, there is a fetish gene, there is all these genes, okay, genetics. Scientists have just discovered that our GNAs have been altered over thousands and thousands of years. I don't know this is my fact, because I haven't done the research. I just read stuff, and I'm just regurgitating it back to you, so you guys can do the research. When you study genetics, you start to realize that there are patterns in everyone. It's a very dangerous thing. If you say, I don't want to hang with these bunch of people because... Da 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 da. Psychologically, psychologically is connected to genetics, right? Okay, there we go. So I'm not gonna say any type of traits, okay, that goes along with these groups of people. But majority of people have the same type of genetics, and most of the time they were raised by single mothers in the household. The single mother syndrome, which I talked about. Okay, you want to try to steer clear from that. I really didn't. Wasn't raised by. Um, two parents, but two, I had two parents in the house. I had a stepfather and I had a mother. Okay, both to them, both to me were uneducated, but they tried their best to raise me, and I had no other choice but to be locked in the house. My teeth was fucked up, and so my mom didn't care enough to fix it. And she, probably that was a plan, okay? Because when saying things are ugly, people stay away from you, okay? So I had a little accident, and my teeth was messed up. I remember that too, and my mom took the welfare system for granted, okay? Like a lot of most of the women take advantage of the system when they're about to hit the wall, whatever, okay? Um, but as I say, I don't hate on women. I talk about it a lot, okay? But I don't hate, okay? 
I don't procrastinate. I usually tell the truth. I even talk about deadbeat mothers and deadbeat fathers. And I talk about how women can protect themselves. But you got to come to me for that knowledge. I don't really spew too much knowledge for women because I know that Kevin Samuels, one of his videos got, I, 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 was, I was always thinking about doing that before he has. Uh, putting women on and actually having discussions and talking to them individually, virtually. But that's now I realize that how much popularity I don't want to do that. <laughs> so I got to keep it on a different subject. I don't want to be popular because of one video. OK, that's how he became known behind the scenes because okay? he saw my video and he liked the things I was doing. But um, my point here is that genetics is important. I digress here. When you study genetics, you start going down that rabbit hole. That's going down the rabbit hole. And then you start to see knuckle-headed moves by people who just do stupid things. Why are bullies born? Why is there so many single mothers? Okay. All this stuff can be connect, connectly, intelligently linked to genetics, guys. What type of genetics I have? I was basically born as a god. Okay, you know, I didn't go out, I didn't socialize, as though I tried to in some kind of way. This I was curious when I tried. I never really fit in. I never really fit in. Because when I tried to do those things, it was like a superficial point to try to socialize. When I was very young, at a very young age. And I did not, though I tried to sin a little bit. I didn't want to go too far because I knew that when I played video games, it was a big old official symbol on this that don't do drugs right and i always took that to heart when i played my video games in arcade ninja turtles way back into the 80s into the 90s right and i remember the cell phones and all that and it was always messages that i always watched today okay? i always i remember tv shows where it said that do you know where your children are at eight o'clock or ten o'clock i remember i'm born back in the 80s into the 90s i'm a gen x yeah so you listen to me right but then I realized as I was walking the streets in Brooklyn, okay, I learned that there are some people who are just knuckleheads. As a matter of fact, most people in general are terrible parents, okay? They're knuckleheads. They're just knuckleheads. I said, why do you not do this? I said, oh, why, why did I think of that? But it's too late because their life is already in the 30s and the 40s. But the moral of what I'm saying is that when you do study genetics, when you do get the time, I have to stop my studies at 25%. Okay, of studies, and I can tell you some facts about genetics, but then I'll be dubbed as a racist. I'm like, how dare you, okay? How dare you say I'm a racist by just doing some research? I that's how people are. Let me give you a great example here. Do you know that um nobody listens to Thomas Sowell really, and nobody really listens to Candy's Owens, and, and nobody listens to Larry Elder, aren't they? And, and you have to understand that these type of individuals who are brought up in a certain particular type of way have a certain type of genetics. And they talk very quickly and they are very astute. Okay? And you've got to understand one thing for certain. There's not a lot of people like that, okay? especially of color. Okay? <laughs> and as beautiful as Candice Owens is, I wish she was a virgin. I always dreamed about that. And Candle, Candle Condoleezza Rice as well. Okay? <laughs> but anyway. I digress here. Um, genetics can happen in a lab. Okay. Um, yes, yes, underground. Human incubators are real babies. Sometimes I believe that some people are uh, genetically modified and created in a laboratory. And I truly believe this because my Holy Spirit told me this. Is that there are people who are modified, genetically modified in laboratories before they're being brought out into, into the world. What type of shit is that? Okay. But anyway, that's all I really want to say because I don't get this video pulled down, but they will pull it down. Right now, YouTube is going on a splurge of uh, demonetizing people because of swearing, which is stupid because a lot of comedians swear, okay, you know. And freedom of speech can be in danger, if, especially if it's being taken over by China, okay, if you know TikTok, you know, that bullshit, okay. But um, if you want your freedom of speech, is you know, a lot of you white liberals have to stand up for it, that's all. Okay, and then the single mother syndrome women can, you know, the feminist movement can stand up for your freedom because that will be all shut down. Okay, there ain't gonna be no feminist movement over in China. Okay, right? But anyway, that's all I gotta say about that, guys. About genetics, you will become a racist. I'll be called racist because it just shows the chromosome. And no, no, don't do that. Okay, I have Indian in my blood. I have German in my blood. I have African in my blood. So no one's not one particular type of race. But other than that, that's all I really got to say for right now because
Come on, Joe and Fresh Pan. I'm not your Peter Pan. <laughs> I am so unique on this fucking YouTube. But of course, I can't be popular because um, YouTube have algorithms. Okay, you got to you got to buy for sponsors. Okay, no, 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 no. Back in the heydays in MySpace, there was no need for that. They controlled the traffic. No matter how unique you are. <laughs> you, I've seen some YouTube channels which is pretty unique and they didn't get enough views. You know, but it's all about you becoming rich and creating your own servers to choose and pick like they do now. Oh, I like this. We're going to monetize that. And, you know, so we, this is why Donald Trump did his own little truth. And then Gitter is out and then Rumble's out and MeWe's out and Signal's out. You make your own platform. Pick and choose which videos should be monetized to make you money. Everything is like a business, baby. True people always do handle things like a business. It's a trade. You you stop giving me this, I stop giving you that. Everything should be like that. No love lost, okay? Because it's all about respect. All right? You respect me. You get two. You get. As a matter of fact, you, with me, you you don't get an eye for an eye. You get eye for two eyes. You respect me. I give you two something back. You take it away. I take everything away from you. Okay, or at least two, two for one deal, two for one. Okay, but anyway, you you saw that video, two for one deal, right? I hope you did, because you're interested in my life and you should join my Patreon. God damn it, twenty dollars a month is not bad compared to what Kevin Samuels was charging. He was charging like four hundred dollars an hour or some shit. Wow, okay, wow, motherfuckers, okay, y'all really are stupid to pay that much for common knowledge and. Harsh critic, okay. But I'm not looking, I'm not casting shade on him. I'm just kind of disappointed in Kevin Samuels on how he didn't keep in touch with me. And he, as I did, I did predict that Andrew Tate would get in trouble, and I did it, okay, right? I always predict all sorts of shit. I predict, like I said, this is off the topic now here. I predict that one day, if they do it right and cleverly, Zelda, Zelda, you know the Zelda series, I realized as I was playing that through my gears in life, okay. When I first played the first Nintendo game on Zelda, that was on Nintendo, okay? And then I realized that Ganon was actually the good guy in so many ways on the Zelda 64, on Nintendo 64. I was like, yo, that's crazy. Ganon is the good guy. Now Zelda is the bad guy. Or Link, as in, he's a clone. You, you don't know that. And that's why you have to go back in time because the soldiers were legion and the king was doing some experiments and shit. Remember that, okay? I predict that if it would go right, okay, Ganon is actually the good guy. And you may play Ganon one day. As a matter of fact, you can play Ganon and Hyrule Warriors. Yes, you can. He was pretty powerful and shit, but he got he got dominated by the king, okay, in Hyrule, okay. But anyway, um, that's beside the point here. If you study genetics, okay. Oh, as a matter of fact, one last thing about Zelda. Zelda, that's like a racist game because, you know, his whole people was wiped out. <laughs> he was black and then they they didn't want the Gerudo tribe to procreate with one another. And there's nothing but sisters there because they killed off all the men. You think I ain't think I ain't, I ain't listening to that shit? Why did they kill off all the men? Okay, You know, racism, obviously. They lived in a desert which used to be lush with green. OK, you know, killed them off. OK. So Link and Zelda are evil. Okay. But anyway, I digress. This is just hypotheticals here. Other than that, I'm a dull average man. I'm not your hater man. <laughs> yeah. I hope you learned something from this goddamn video. Unscripted. I don't I don't do scripts again, okay, you know. I've been on radio shows and talk shows, yes I have. Yes I have, okay, but very rarely you'll find me again. I don't want to be found by majority of masses of asses. And if you do find me and you offer me a deal, we doing everything virtual, baby. Everything is going to be a wire transfer, okay? <laughs> That's what I'm trying to do. I have a Patreon. You can, you can hook me up through my Patreon, guys. But if you don't like my content, but I do got people who are joining my Patreon. Thank you very much. But I'm only interested in a few elite because majority of the time, people are out to get you. You're going to stay over there, and I'm going to stay over here. No need to send me money to be flying. You can fly me out nowhere, because I ain't going nowhere for no money, okay? But you can you can transfer your bank accounts, and we can do a Zoom, whatever. 
that's different, okay? Other than that, that's all I really got to say, guys. I love animals more than humans, but I don't fuck the animals. No, don't do that. Peace.